We got a bunch of online orders. Thank everyone that purchased something. Let's get into it. Julio grab Final Fantasy Chronicles complete. Joseph grab Yeez eight. Beautiful copy. Robert grab Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky. Almost complete, missing the manual. Great purchase on that. That's been in here for a whit. I was not sure this was ever gonna sell. And Lil grabbed one of these guys. You know these are my favorite things to ship. They actually are not. I really do not like shaping these, but luckily, the Gibsons have this. This is a godsend. This helps shipping. The neck comes off. It's amazing. So we're going to go ahead, get everything packaged up right now, get it boxed. The funny thing is we just threw this away, but I'm actually going to use it for the guitar. Now the guitar almost kind of can fit if we put it, you know, some direction. We're not going to do that. We're going to make the box longer. So. There is a box technique to cutting. What you really want is a box. Postman just came and we got boxes of stuff. A pretty big box, actually. I wonder what's in the box. You know what? I don't know. We're going to focus on this right now. We're going to make a box before we open a box. So back to what I was saying, we really want a box that if we put our stuff in, about half the box would be used and that's kind of where we're at with this one right here so half of our stuff will be about half the box which is perfect so i have this guy right here and what we're going to do is put our packages on here what we want to do is score the inside of the box distance we need for the package to be about halfway the box or you can literally just score half the box and you want to score everything so like so I've scored the middle of the box we're just going to keep that going Way through, we need to take the bottom of the box part, and that should be scored, and that should be scored, and all we should have to do now is fold it. Do is fold it at each end like so. So it stays. Now we have an elongated box that should fit both of our items in there nice and snug. We'll put some. Uh, filler, bubble wrap and paper in here, probably at the bottom as well. And this thing will be ready to ship. So really you need the same type of like height as your item. And as long as it's half the box, you'll be able to make a, an elongated box out of that box. It's an interesting technique. Literally learned it from TikTok. I tested a couple times, kept trying to refine it. And that's how I learned. So there you go. That guy is all done, ready to be shipped out. So is everything else. Oh no. No! Oh, son of a! My roof is leaking again. All right, this is a trade that we just got in. Guitar Hero Two in the box with the guitar. Um, no Guitar Hero Two. We're just gonna take that one, put him in the box, complete that. PlayStation, a couple PlayStation games, some decent PS2 stuff. Believe most of it is complete. A PS3, we had to take a controller out. Uh, two PlayStations with two controllers and a bunch of Pokemon 3DS games. Now there was more. 
a couple PlayStation, PS2 that doesn't read the disc, a couple controllers that are pretty bad, need new sticks. This whammy bar is broken that we just threw in a bottle for a couple extra bucks. So this is majority of it right here. Pretty much from here over is what I paid for. Jordan's back here, Lorelai's back here. What are you doing, Lorelai? I am uh, taking apart a Pokemon Red game and replacing the battery on it. She also has this copy of, this Japanese copy of Silver. And uh, yeah, this is her, what, second time doing this? Mm-hmm. Nice, just doing it all by herself. So if she screws it up, it's her problem. <laughs> While she's been doing that, I got most of the stuff that we just got traded in in stock. All of this needs to be labeled and put on the shelf, PS3. We're knocking through. We just got some Xbox games. I'll show you in a second. Grand Theft Auto, Rocket League, Ride 2, and Mud Run. Yes, in here, and uh, it's definitely a spider that's been living in here. Sweet. I like spider NESs. Where are you, spider? But we're almost done. We uh, adjusted the pins right in here. So I take them and I move these pins up just a little bit. we we'll clean them with a wire brush, isopropyl alcohol. Make sure the contacts are all good. With this, we need to put the cover on and all the screws, but this thing is working perfectly fine now. It's been cleaned. It's much better and slides in so much easier. And this is perfect because we got our Sega back. So that's awesome. PSP games. Some of them need to be shell replaced, but we'll get to these hopefully soon. Uh, Mario, this is what, six golden coins, I believe. Harry Potter, Pokemon Black, and Sapphire. This up again, thank you, Shannon, I appreciate it. I don't think I told you, he brought in the last DS stuff. Guess what? He brought more. Little extra. We got the Game & Watch, a bunch of great filler titles for the store. We got some Switch titles, Pokemon 3DS, some more Pokemon. It's a Pokemon kind of day, guys. Resident Evil, Sunshine, Metroid. We got some really uncommon stuff, DuckTales. Game Boy Advance, another Warrior Twisted. And he gave us this um, DS Lite. This one, unfortunately, wasn't charging properly, but we swapped out the battery, and that was the problem. So we got a new battery in it and it's charging all the psp stuff we got plus everything we are back now the glass case is full of stuff which means we need to get through it right now thank you guys for watching as always i'll see you next time don't forget to love the